Hi everybody, welcome back to SCOM. This is a difficult mission apparently. Not very difficult, just difficult, uh, which is interesting. Uh, I've decided to make an EMP grenade. Uh, oh, sorry, EMP bomb instead of the grenade. I don't know what happened to my grenade. It's just gone, so now I got an EMP bomb. That's kind of worth it. So, the double. this is a 10 damage grenade, opposed to this 5 to 6 damage plasma grenade, but I get two of these and some shred. So I figure the EMP bomb is going to be my ace in the hole if there's some really bad shit going on. Uh, we obviously brought Kand along. Kand is going to be here to do his... I figure we really need a Psy operative. Uh, we need the Psy operative because we can mind control someone else to be on our side. Uh, I would have wanted a hacker, but I think... I honestly think that this is... Uh, uh, having a heavy is much more clutch and obviously we need the sniper and I... I, I always go with the, um, the typical maximum critical chance stuff because that shit is really clutch and also I have the race suit right yes I do so as far as I know we're gonna start this without concealment so that could be bad but I guess we'll see this is the the things I got and also no healer the so figure nobody needs healing if there's no enemies to attack you but we'll just be very careful I mean typically in the missions we do we don't have a healer anyways so or we don't need one I should say so hopefully we'll be okay. Commander, it's time we put Advent down for the count. This will be a two-pronged assault. First, we hack the heart of the Advent Tower and disrupt their network before the speaker finishes his latest broadcast. Shen's cooking up a little surprise for them that should more than get their attention. With Advent in an uproar, we'll access the portal and take the fight to their front door. All goes well, they won't even see us coming. It's risky, but it's the best shot we'll get. Once we start this, there's no turning back. You know, I now kind of regret not bringing the hacker along because there's actually there's an actual hack to do. But I don't know about having that. Oh, hey, there's a advent dropship right there. Move to infiltrate the network tower. Locate the access point and hack in to seize the broadcast signal. Uh, it honestly actually depends upon if uh, we're timed right now, which it doesn't seem so. So we got uh, we got some squad bonuses right now, so that's kind of good. Absolutely. All right, so we we do we're gonna play this in X uh, classic XCOM style, What's over there? where we're going to be very Don't careful uh, moving up, P just simply because <laughs> we got lots of time, guys. Or maybe we don't, and I just don't know. This is blind. What can I say? Alright. Uh what's our mobility just sucks ass. I'm trusting you here. Like it's just like I wanna go up into that one, but I can't. Sure thing. I'm on it. Got it covered. It's too dangerous for me to move out uh, out really far because I don't have concealment. Like, like, I would like nothing more than just to run right to that thing, but, you know. You, you can't, it's too dangerous, you know. Can't do it, guys. Alright, let's get to this small cover here. Well, looks like they're not really here. I guess that'll be okay. Let's just one square be the difference. It could have been. Could have been the difference. All right, we're gonna move our sniper up here. Overwatch. All righty. This cover is absolute trash too. Oh, there's a patrol right here. So if we were in concealment right now, it would right now be broken. Not even close. You know, we could just mind control that guy, can't we? That seems like a nice guy to mind control. <laughs> The thing is, we could also have a gatekeeper somewhere, you know? Uh, it depends how much if, if, if we can get a hit here. There we go. Alright, we're gonna try and mind control him. Because he's got armor, he's got explosives. Alright, let's see. Uh, let's go right here. It's all low cover here, except for this. I'm, up, I'm actually I'm okay with this. Here. Okay, let's see. We got we got a shit ton of abilities here. Domination. It's not uh, that's that's a good chance. 
We need we need someone to kind of be along with us, so it's more like a four man squad though. Honestly, I would have been okay with just like having a four man like like sorry three man like size squad. It actually would have been pretty cool. We'll do this one. And it's a crit. That went really well. Alright, so we're gonna just move up here. What the hell? What the heck is that guy? Oh, there's some more here. That's not good. I might actually suppress. Oh, what's the... What's the thing here? What is that that I can blow up? Uh, that's a, like a little thing here. Uh, we're gonna suppress the uh, this guy right here. Let's do this as safe as possible, guys. Just because we kind of fucked up and we got the one square that they were in. I mean, I assumed someone was there, so that was my fault. Mike's a baddie. Oh, he's gonna have a grenade. Ah, uh, this is not a good way to start this off. Acid burn and everything. No heals at all. Taking heavy fire. All right. Medic. Yeah, we're gonna take a bit of acid burn damage. Ah. Uh, this is not a good way because I don't I don't know how much more we're gonna have to do with this mission. Okay, what's he got? He's got an acid bomb. I mean, this is not a charge-based thing, so... I wish one of these guys was like a healer. Now here's the nice thing. Um, Ken can actually heal himself. He's immune to that. Of course he is. He's got a giant suit for that. Why wasn't I thinking about that? Alright. An EMP bomb, we got a plasma grenade, so... Plasma blaster. So here's what we're gonna do. Can's gonna actually go over here. If you say so. And Can can heal himself. So he's got soul fire for this. We're gonna take I out the Archon. And he's not too happy with that result. That's the nice thing about him, but Pat Pat is not so lucky. Pat can't do that. Uh, I'm kind of wondering where the... So I see like some high cover here, but it's only on that side, which is not great. We're gonna move Pat over here. The hope here is that maybe we can take out this Archon guy. Yep, and the answer is yes we can. The next question is what do we do with that guy over here? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if Deadeye is going to be able to do the job. What? Oh, what kind of crit is this? 108% chance to crit. Alright, fine. Alright. Uh, that guy's going to turn into the other thing, though, anyways, if we take him out. Alright, well, let's see what happens now. Just going to kind of casually move through all of this. Oh, he's okay. Alrighty. Uh, let's see. We got like Psy rail guns and some other stuff here. I think Soulfire has a nice cooldown to it. That's not good. How, how long is he going to burn from the acid for? I mean, she can heal herself. Pat can't. Let's have a look here. Oh, what? No, no, I want to move here. Ah, uh, this stupid thing. I want to move one more square over. I don't know. I haven't reloaded so far. The no point in starting now. Oh, I did it. And now it's going to be in machine mode. But now it actually shouldn't be in cover anymore, right? Because I think machines can't take cover quite the same way. Yeah, it looks like it can't. 
Ah, uh, yeah, it's, Pat's gonna have to reload. Okay, with when it comes to Pat, I am going to just wait a sec. Let's see, stasis him. We can stasis him. Why is that the only thing we can shoot? Still 108% chance to crit. I, I don't know why. Alright. We gotta just get one more shot off on him. Dan can probably easily do this. Although it just doesn't look like he can. I don't know why. That's, maybe we can use something else like the no Lance. Maybe we'll just no Lance him. Screw it. I need some I need some guaranteed damage just to make sure he's I not not like a problem anymore. He even fell off the bridge. That's crazy actually. Yeah, I'm gonna tell Pat to hunker down. I don't think that does anything against the acid damage he's taking, but maybe it's gone now. Yeah, it looks like it's gone now anyways. We're gonna be extra careful with uh, Pat now. Alright, so let's decide how we want to move this up. I guess that'll be okay. Pat's going to be a little bit more careful now these days. I mean, if this is all they have so far, we're in pretty good shape then. That seems fine. They didn't put a whole lot of effort into disguising the alien tech involved. The design may be a function of the network itself. The amount of psionic energy filtered through that system is beyond measure. All right. I mean, we should still be good. We'll just play it safe. Don't worry, guys. We also have this guy to just lead us. He's got like he's gonna tank through it all, you know. All right, they got two of these Archon guys. One of these. This is appears to be the running theme of this entire mission here. Alright, he's staying behind cover. Let's go and just throw one of these nice acid bombs here. I can do a void rift, maybe. I think we'll void rift it. I think I can hit all of them with this. Come on, we're, we're like literally in this like kind of zone. Wait, is that now that guys? Oh, there we go. Look at look at this, pixel perfect, guys. Pixel perfect. I actually, hopefully, this doesn't, doesn't destroy the bridge. I haven't actually been taking that into account. All right, what Pat might end up doing is he might actually end up throwing a grenade in here because I don't like all these guys being alive. It depends, actually. Can we? What the heck is this? Oh yeah, that's right. He has the chance to debuff people. Actually, he's panicked. So maybe, maybe we don't actually have to worry about it as much. Actually, if they're all debuffed, then I'm not going to care. It's a really great, really great spell. This is why I brought the Psy Soldier along for this. So he decided to run away. And what's he going to shoot? His friend. That's that's good. Good for us. They're just gonna shoot each other. I thought they'd usually shoot enemies when they panic. That's okay. I'm fine with that. All right. What do we have now? We got Dead Eyes back off cooldown. That's not a good chance to hit him though. What we might do is we might just kill zone this. If anybody moves, we'll just take a shot. Here comes the next and Pat will just overwatch. overwatch. Oh, he just took a crap ton of da damage from acid burn. See, my whole plan with this was to confer a reaction shot when they move, but they're panicked, so I guess they're not going to do that, are they? Which means we're going to blow a hole, hole open in this guy's cover. Yeah, he can shoot that guy, I don't care. I got a free shot at least.
You know, I didn't actually check to see if they had... Oh, wow. Dude, that guy does actually a lot of damage. I didn't actually realize that. Alright, let's see. Let's get Pat up there, maybe. Pat can actually move here. On my way. I want to remove that guy's cover, but it looks like I'm not going to be able to do that. How about... What else does he have here? He's got a plasma blaster. Too far away still. Is it... Is this going to remove the cover? I think it will, actually. I can do this, but it'll remove his cover. So here's what we're going to do. We'll remove him over here. And then we're going to... Do this cannon thing. I just want to make sure that guy's also getting hit. Like, I think he is. I can't really tell. There's a lot in the way. I guess not, because he wasn't. It doesn't matter. It sets up my sniper, though. Except it probably isn't going to do that. Uh, or maybe it will, because I'll just maybe shoot him. Yeah, let's just shoot him. And now we can dead I am. So here, you know, there's an interesting question. If that machine dies, uh, I'm going to assume that it turns into something that isn't my friend. Because it gets the automated stuff takes control. So even though, it's an interesting question because it's like, the operator is mind controlled, but the machine is technically still an enemy. Alright, it died to acid burn, we're good. This stuff has to get out of the way though. I did that during my turn though, so... Okay, he's just gonna bash through this. Actually, he, he's, he's fine. Now, let's just go right here, and then we'll be sure that there's nothing in here. Okay, so, I don't know why, but that place looks really defensible. Um, so... This, this actually implies that uh, we're about to maybe have a defend mission where they're, they're, we're going to take this over. And oh, I think they're yeah. going to come pit, get you pissed and, and uh, try and shut off the signal. Like, I, as I said, I've never played this, but I'm guessing that's what's going to happen because I see a lot of full cover there. Let's get everybody over there first. Cause look at this! Look at this full cover. This full cover is insane. Location confirmed. Yeah, Pat's gonna come over here too. Target in range. Move to hack the command console. I'm just gonna guess that like a dropship's gonna come down. Ah, oh, yeah, there's a guy, some guys up there, but that's okay. All right, let's hack the terminal then. See what happens here. Keep an eye out while I work. <laughs> there's a little bit of sparkly glowy shit in the way. Well, we don't really need any of this though. See, he's can the king of hackers. No, he isn't. Fine. I don't think we need alien allies at this point in the game. Piece of cake. Status confirmed. We have control of the network tower. The signal is going out. Oh, that's it. It's just over. Uh, that's awkward. Resistance. Well done, Doctor. Yes, it would appear the feedback pulse is having the intended effect. Shen, status. Did it work? Advent assures us this breakthrough will be available to all citizens immediately. We go live to the speaker for more. Fellow citizens, for 20 years we have put our trust in Advent, in the elders, because we believe a better future is possible for all. Today, that trust, that belief, has been rewarded. Advent peacekeeping forces are traveling across the world, carrying the greatest gift from the Elder. A revolutionary gene therapy, yes. But 
so much more. This is an end to disease, to decay, to pain. The beginnings of a new tomorrow, available to all of us today. Truly, humanity finally takes its rightful place amongst the stars. There's random pictures on the screen. Get him! You know, it could have been fabricated. You never know. Hey, everyone came back. Sort of. Alright. Why are we still here, though? What, what's our... Wait, wait, what are we supposed to do right now? Uh... Isn't that the end of the game? This is it, Commander. Oh. It's time we put an end to this, once and for all. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna just I'm gonna cut it up, but I'll upload it in the same day. So uh, remember, guys, we will be watching. Take care.